Ray. Ray Love, what's going on, man? Layla, yeah, the manager yeah, yeah. of Tupac when he was younger, right? And his oh. mentor. His, and the yeah. mentor. So you guys are both like the mentors. His second mom. No, 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 no. And this then, is Adrian Gregory too. Okay. This is this is one of the mentors right here. This is uh, management. This is the, in the beginning label. All made the, the, the deal go oh, down. Made nice. the deal go Absolutely. down. Absolutely. So the movie is getting released when? We you don't guys, know. Uh, we don't know. I heard rumors that filming starts at the beginning of next year. Beginning of next year. And okay. There's a story that we just posted up, right? Suge Knight was saying that Tupac should get a, a star on the Walk of Fame. Right. I think he's already getting one. Yeah. He's gonna get one. He's gonna get one. Yeah. Okay. Nice. All right. We I need. Mean, we, we need one. Where do he you, deserves where, it more than anybody? Exactly. Where should he get? Where should he get it? Like, where do you want him, the star to be at? Hollywood and Vine. Hollywood and Vine. Yeah. Right there by Katsuya. Why yeah. Why, All right. Why not? <laughs> that's not that's I think. I think his needs to cover a whole block. Because <laughs> brothers is hard to kill. <laughs> you know what? It's funny because uh, I found Elvis's star and the Beatles star. They got their own on La Brea Boulevard, right? And it's like a huge, they got like five blocks of the star, you know what I mean? Right. So two blocks should get at least two or three maybe. Yeah, he should, he should, he should get five. I think streets being named after him. I think that his imprint as ever. Actually, now they have college courses on, on Tupac yeah. lyrics They've as been. well. Yeah. yeah. For a we, long we time. taught a couple. We started the first one. Berkeley. Arvon. Hey, you, Berkeley. You, you, I taught yeah. that with Arvon. Yeah. Oh, wow. Arvon started it. He was a student. What's your... he's a med he was a medical student. Now he's a trauma specialist. You know, one of my homegirls took that class and she actually gave me the uh, the textbook. That's awesome. Yeah. Don't have that I, I read that textbook. <laughs> I read that whole textbook. Mm -hmm. what, what, Layla, what is your favorite uh, Tupac lyric? Uh, that would be really hard for me to answer. Yeah, because you love so many of them. That's like asking which child you love the most. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. In different ways, we would love them all. The course is, I'm guessing the course is pretty hard. Uh, like, do you, do you make, did you make the test? I've written curriculum. There are probably 50 of us at least that now develop curriculum because his songs were like curriculum for uh -huh. many people. It's like Shakespeare, like 100 years from now people are going to be looking at. He's the voice of the generation, and many to follow. Absolutely, thank you guys. So so I have a question for you guys. So you three are some of the most influential <laughs> on the life of the man who is most influential over us. I would say that we are um, the beginning of his artistry transforming to commerce and changing just having a dream to reality. Yeah. And uh, what I'd also say is in many ways Tupac managed the three of us and managed everyone around him and discovered how we all could facilitate him. So it's kind of a, a misnomer to say that we all did it. We did a lot of it. One of the things we like to say is we didn't drop the ball. Nice. You know, the ball was constantly transferred and transferred and transferred. We did our part in not dropping the ball and making sure the transfer went smooth. And being aware, too, that, that Tupac is a, a team effort. When you say Tupac, you're talking about 20 people that probably dedicated the majority of their adult life to making that happen and still posthumously after death doing the same thing. So this is a, a great night. We all get to see each other and get together and hang out. We haven't seen each other in, in a long, yeah. long time. This is so. like so many of us coming together I guess we love Tupac. I got one last question for you guys. Did Does anybody own the rights to Thug Life? Just this is saying a, Thug Life. That's a good question. A I question. imagine I imagine somebody does. Because you know, know in the movies they are saying Thug Life. You know what I mean? They they use it now. Right. I'm wondering if somebody owns that at all or uh, I would say yes. Pac yeah. owns it. <laughs> The okay. spirit of Puck. Cool. All right. well, and how is it now that like all these years have passed and you guys just continue to see his impact just keep growing and just keep like he's got more influence over our world than any of us do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And we're alive. It's pretty we're amazing. here. Yeah, it's pretty I amazing. always yeah. say Special. That his voice at times is more powerful than the school system, <laughs> than our politicians, that he speaks to the heart of the planet. And we fail to recognize that all the stuff that we know from him, he was under 25 years old. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Just a kid. Talk about, and they say it's the white man I should fear, but it's my own kind doing all the killing here. Hey, this, this guy raps I <laughs> all the time. You don't I understand. Love that. <laughs> he rapped to me last time. Yeah. yeah, he rapped to me last time too. Are you guys ready? Yeah. All right. Love you guys. Have a nice one. See y'all inside. Have a good one. All right, Ray. I'll see you inside. Yeah. All right, good to see you. Thank you.
Yeah.